Good morning, guys, and welcome to another review from me, Matt, the Bit of Berserker. Hope you're having a fantastic day wherever you are, whatever you're getting up to. Bearing in mind it's only nine o'clock, so just going to change my camera angle a bit. Yeah, it's only nine o'clock, so I hope you have a great day wherever you are in the world. And thank you for joining me for another review. Now, thank you so, so much to each and every single one of you out there that subscribe to my channel, watching my videos, liking my videos and commenting on them. I'm just an old man with an iPad in front of him, trying to help and do his best to support, promote, advertise and help small brands, individuals and craftsmen only that are making some amazing products and not these huge, Massive faceless brands that just pump out passionless stuff onto the market. And with all the reviews that I do on my channel, stuff that gets sent through to me, stuff that I go out and buy myself, all of my reviews are completely honest. Everything I do is my own opinion and I'm completely unbiased. So if there's a reason I love a product, I will say constructively why I like it. If there's a reason I don't like a product equally constructively, I will say why I don't like it. So grab your coffee to start with. Mm -mm -mm. Weather seems to be easing off a bit out there at the moment, so not as bad. Mm -mm. Can't beat coffee. So, I broke my glasses yesterday, I've had to fix them with sellotape, so if I do look a bit weird while I'm doing this review, it's because I sat on my glasses. I can just about see out of it. It does look a bit foggy on this side, but this review has been very kindly sent through to me from Soap Good Soap sorry, So Good Soap, uh, based in Croydon, who have sent me through some soaps to have a look at and a beard oil as well, because what they create is skincare and skin protection, soaps, body butters, candles, bath bombs and more. All of their products are 100% natural. It's all handmade and designed for all skin types. So the packaging itself we'll look at first. And with all the packaging, there was no plastic involved. It's all recyclable, which is absolutely brilliant stuff because there is so much plastic and sort of like stuff that you can't get rid of nowadays. So it is nice to see that all the packaging is biodegradable, recyclable, fantastic stuff to start with. So let's say the products turned up in a box. This is a box, a whole box flat written on the side should you need to reheat the pizza this is not a pizza but it's a little pizza box that it came in but it's good handmade natural so good soaps beneficial soaps for eczema acne psoriasis and all minor skin conditions www.sogoodsoap.co.uk links will be down below in that their description box so that was the packaging it came in so this is the little leaflet that was inside uh, Non-toxic, 100% safe, BPA-free, no bisphenol A, vegan, plastic-free, so good soaps, uh, Instagram and a telephone number as well. Um, these do, this uh, brand does supply to shops as well as sell them online. Eco-friendly and certified sustainable palm oil rspo beneficial soaps for skin conditions such as eczema acne psoriasis chemical free sls free paraben free and sulfate free because let's face it a lot of the stuff that we do buy soaps shampoos skincare and stuff from these huge boots and places like that they're not particularly natural so it is nice to see because everyone nowadays is a lot more aware of what they're putting on the skin and face also available hair and body and beard oil 100% natural treat your body get 15% off on orders over 30 quid handmade products for all skin types heal and moisturize your skin with natural Ghanaian shea body she body butter free delivery on orders over 25 quid only use essential oils and plant-based fragrant oils really really nice um, customer service with these guys has been brilliant constantly sort of like chatting between each other on Instagram hope you like it what do you think of it please let us know and all my reviews are on us so First of all, we're going to be looking at the beard oil, a big whopping 100ml beard oil. Uh, comes in a brown amber glass bottle, 
reason if you don't know why beard oils tend to come in amber color bottles, greens, blacks, blues, especially stops UV rays from getting inside the bottle, damaging and de degrading all the oils. So good soap, 100% natural beard oil, jojoba and argan, and www.sogoodsoaps. Carrier oils, jojoba, argan oil, hemp oil, avocado oil, castor oil, almond oil, sunflower oils, with essential oil of lemongrass, vanilla, lavender, ylang ylang and lemon. Comes with rubber pipette on the top, pipette, um, which is my preferred method of delivering beard oils. I haven't got a problem with the pumps. Ones I'm not particularly keen on are the ones with the stem that goes inside the bottle because I just end up sending it everywhere. And I've tried this, I've used it, I've actually got it in my beard this morning. It's quite a pale yellow colour, quite a thick oil this one. It's not one of those sort of weak ones that just tends to go everywhere. Now, I tend not to smell beard oils from the bottle because scent seem to change once you start generating a bit of heat through it. And I do have a scale at the side here, very, very subtle for the scent, regular sort of scent. Rip your head off and kick it into next week. Like I said, it's got a high viscosity, this one. And I'm gonna rate that around about three quarters, just under three quarters of the way up here. So it's slightly stronger than what you would normal have. Beautiful balanced scent of the sweet orange in there, the lemon, the lang lang and sweetness as well of vanilla. Almost kind of, it's got a citrus scent to it, but almost like a winter Christmassy scent. This would go so well with a cinnamon beard balm, should you wish to use a beard oil and balm in conjunction, or beard butter as well. Um, it is a decent thick oil, this one, which kind of surprises me, because when you see huge bottles of oil, especially 100 mil, because we're used to with beards and everything being 30 mil bottles, 50 mil bottles. Very rarely do you get a 100 mil bottle. Um, I have done test patch on this. I've not had any problems with itchiness, redness, dry, flaky skin. But you kind of assume big bottle of oil, it's not gonna be very good. And I have to be honest, for a brand that kind of deals with soaps and candles and bath bombs and stuff like that, I was expecting the beard oil not to be good and it is actually one of the best beard oils I've actually used. It's right up there in my top 10. It's such a good beard oil. The scent lasts on average for around about three hours. And the thing that I like about it is the quality of the products. It's all natural ingredients. <coughs> it absorbs into the skin nice and quickly. And I've had no problems with redness, itchiness, flakiness, skin, or anything like that. Always recommended to do a test patch first because the last thing you want to do, slather it all over your face, and then you end up with a breakout or something like that. And for 100 mils, I was expecting sort of 20, 25 quid, 12 pound. 12 pound for 100 mils. Bearing in mind, I use anywhere between eight to 10 drops now on my beard a day, maybe a couple more. Um, drops in my beard before bed. Um, this is gonna last you ages. Um, it's such a good beard oil, I cannot rate this enough. No downsides to that whatsoever. Really good scent, lasts ages, and you can smell all the individual scents from that. And moving on, they're very kindly as well, sent me through some soaps. Which is why the company or brand, small brand, it's called So Good Soap. First off, the packaging. This is one of them that they've sent through. They do two different sizes. They do a 50 gram bar and they also do a 110 gram bar. Packaging, eco-friendly, looks like recycled card that's gone on it. Each product has got its ingredients written on it, the same as the beetle, as they should have. Um, so good soap.co.uk batch number as well, which is good to see that each soap that they've sent through has got a different batch number on it from Croydon in the UK. Ingredients water, grapeseed oil, coconut oil, castor oil, olive oil, sodium hydroxide, uh, oats, honey, turmeric, fragrance, oil of honey, and rose. 
have used each and every single one of these and tried them. The other half has used them as well and sat there last night after we reviewed or we used two the day before and two last night and sat there and dried them all out and kept all the sleeves and everything as good as we possibly can do. These are really, really nice. The honey, oats and turmeric is probably my favorite. The oats are really good as well for exfoliating. And they did send another one through, clove bud, which you got the clove, if I pull the sleeve off, you can see all the clove buds, I'm gonna sneeze. Don't you hate that when you wanna sneeze and you know you're gonna sneeze, but you can't sneeze. <laughs> Excuse me. You can see all the clove buds in there, so again, a good exfoliator. This one as well, ingredients, water, olive oil, coconut oil, avocado oil, grapeseed oil, sodium hydroxide, uh, clove bud powder, clove oil. And it's not overpowering clove, even though these are scented. Got a lavender one here as well, and a bubblegum one. They're not too overpowering. You get the slight scent from it, but they're not knock your head off stuff, which is nice. Really, really good quality soaps. I love the fact that they're handmade. I like the way that they've, they're not sort of like cut completely square. They've got that rustic feel to it, that crafted feel. Um, each one of these is brilliant. Even one for the kids as well. You've got, well, adults as well. I love bubble gum. Um, there's a bubble gum scented one. Kind of got the marbling of bubble gum on there. Ingredients, water, palm oil, coconut oil, castor oil, olive oil, sunflower oil, orange essential oil, and bubblegum fragrance oil. The lavender one as well. Ingredients, water, olive oil, grapeseed oil, palm oil, coconut oil, sodium hydroxide, essential oil, and lavender. And these got sort of like the purple. And you can see all the bits of lavender in there. Funny enough, just up the road from where I live in Heacham, we've got one of uh, Norfolk Lavender that does loads of lavender. And these soaps are really, really good. I do have, without sounding weird or anything, kind of sensitive skin that I do suffer from dry skin from time to time, especially on my face. This has really helped to kind of moisturize I've had no issues at all with it. Obviously, I wouldn't recommend eating them, but the honey, oats, and turmeric one, wherever that's gone, I've lost it now, is by far my favorite one. It's just, it's got that sort of slight honey scent to it, and the oats, and it just reminds me of porridge. It's almost one of those sort of scents, and you just want to eat it. It looks like you can eat it as well. Never a good idea to eat soap. But they're stunning products and ridiculously cheap priced as well. So for a 50 gram buy, you're paying £2.50 and a 110 gram buy, you're paying a fiver. I would much rather go out and buy one of these at a fiver than I would to nip down to supermarket or whatever and pick up one of their bars of soap from in there because I love the way they've been crafted. I love the ethics behind what they're doing. They're really stunning products, really well made. The packaging is absolutely fantastic. The price is, is a good price and they do loads of different scents as well. As that, they do the bath bombs. I believe they do candles as well. Yeah, soaps, body butters, candles, bath bombs and more. And like I say, standout products alone is the beard oil and the honey, oats and turmeric soap. Absolutely beautifully made. There's not a problem with any of them. Those two are my particular favourites. And going back to the beard oil, for 100 mils for £12. Really, really well made oil. Nice scent to it. Long lasting scent. Fantastic products. And out of 20, I love everything about them. So I'm scoring them quite happily. 20 out of 20. I think the price is cheap when you consider £12 for a 100ml beard oil. Usually you're paying around about 13 quid for around about 30 mils, maybe slightly more on a 50ml bottle. The soaps, £2.50 or £5 is not going to break the bank. Beard oil is going to last you ages. Packaging is great. Customer service has been excellent. So 
straight up 20 out of 20. Thank you so, so much uh, for so good so for sending these through. Links will be down below in the description box. I recommend anyone to try these guys. And thank you. I hope you've enjoyed this review this morning. If anyone has any questions, comments, please comment down below in the description box. I do read and will respond to each and every single comment that is made. Um, a lot of people have been asking, well, why do you score your product so highly? I have had some really bad products through, um, six of them now so far since I've been doing this that have scored five and under. And the brands have asked me to pull the videos and everything, bin the products and so that. But it's nice to see that whatever it is, whether it's soaps, candles, leather work, woodworking, metal working, all sorts of bits and pieces, that they are putting so much time, effort, energy, and they have so much passion in what they're doing that they they know as soon as they release their products out onto the market that they're going to be in direct competition with these other brands. So they have to make their products as good as they possibly can do. And it obviously shows in the products that they are creating. So I hope you've enjoyed this review out there. If there is anybody out there that doesn't need any help, support or whatever, please comment down below. Send us a message over there on Instagram where I'm there is Viking Beer Mat. Love to hear from you guys and really want to keep this channel going. I hope you are enjoying the content that I am putting out, bearing in mind I just have my iPad in front of you. So if you are expecting sort of flashy graphics popping up intros and outros, you're not going to get it here because I'm sure you're more interested in the products. And... What I have set up is not about me at all, which is why when you see photos over on Instagram, I always sort of try and take myself back in black and white and have the products on show because it's about the products and not me. So thank you guys, wherever you are in the world, keep on taking care of each other, keep on helping, supporting each other, and above all, keep on loving each other because you only live once, so make the most of it. Thank you guys. I look forward to seeing you in another review from me, Matt. Peter Berserker. Have a great day, guys. Appreciate it. And thank you so much to So Good Soaps. Thank you.